The Justice Department is fighting in court to stop multiple states from cleaning up their voter rolls in the weeks before Election Day. The latest battle is unfolding in Virginia, where the DOJ filed a lawsuit on October 11th to stop the state from removing non-citizens from voter registration records. Republican Governor Glenn Youngkin slammed the lawsuit, calling it a, quote, desperate attempt to attack the legitimacy of the elections in the Commonwealth. The battle centers on whether Virginia officials can remove registered voters suspected of being non-citizens from the voter rolls. The DOJ is citing federal law that bans systemic maintenance on voter registration records within 90 days of an election. The Biden-Harris DOJ used a similar argument in a lawsuit in Alabama over that state's efforts to purge the rolls. Alabama officials wanted to shift roughly 3,000 registered voters to inactive status. They said those people received alien numbers from the Department of Homeland Security, which gives those numbers to identify non-citizens. But the DOJ wants to stop work on the voter rolls so close to the election. These lawsuits come as legal battles continue over non-citizen voting, mail-in ballots, and counting votes that may trickle in after Election Day. Sarah Bedford for The Washington Examiner.